We're in, uh, what would you call this, mate? Fun zone. A fan zone, okay. Um, obviously, Carlisle support us, yeah? Yeah. 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 How do you think your season's been so far? No. Oh, I mean, seriously, no messing around. Don't be I, get th I, I thought we were going to struggle, but yeah. I thought we'd be a little bit better than what we are. This is really uneducated of us from coming from <laughs> Oxford. Where best are you in the league? 23rd. 23rd, yeah. You're one off from yeah, the bottom. second from bottom, yeah, with 20 points. Unbelievable. I, I really, oh, that shocks me. That shocks me, Ross. Yeah, you know, I thought I mean, you were at this table. Yeah, I thought you were at this table. I don't know what made me think you were any different. But um, um, And what do you think of the fan zone for the youngsters here, then? Quite good, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, see, we got nothing like this. I think it's fantastic. We're, plus, we're, plus as well, it's only three quid a pint. That's oh, 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 very half 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 <laughs> what beer are you on then? Foster's. Oh, you, you cheap stuff, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I believe three quid. Three, what did I pay for the Moretti? Oh, Fiverr. Jesus Christ. Oh, you know, I believe it. Um, did you come down? To, have you ever been to Oxford or anywhere? No, pass through it. Never, never, never been to Kazan. No, okay. Yeah. Do you do away games sometimes for your dad? Sometimes. Yeah. yeah often. Where have we been this season? Wigan, Bolton. Just kind of the northern ones. Yeah, the yeah, northern yeah, ones. Yeah. Which it's a bit of a trek as yeah. you know to get up here. <laughs> what we do, we, the supporters buses? Um, we went on the supporters bus for Bolton. But for Bolton, Wigan. yeah, and to Wembley. Play yeah, our final last season. Don't, yeah. don't oh. big it up anymore than you're yeah. trying to do, mate. <laughs> <laughs> what was and that for? For the play of final, was player final, yeah. And how did you enjoy that? That oh, was quite good. Do you like Wembley, yeah? Yeah, it must be nice for you. Can't beat winning on penalties, can you? Yeah, but you must enjoy that coming down to London, really. Oh, yeah, yeah, it was good. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. But uh, yeah. to, to be fair, we've just been talking about accents, okay? And your accent is quite a northern accent. Both well, you. mine, well, I'm from Manchester, so mine's not a Carlisle accent. He's, he's Cumbrian lad. He's well, born and bred. just Cumbria, blown so. that, Josh. Yeah, that's yeah, it, no, really. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. Okay. But was you born in Carlisle, were you? No, no, no. So what, what are you... Moved up 20... You married a bloke? 23 years ago. I married a woman. Oh, well, could have married a woman. Yeah, okay, you, okay, you married, so married, you married, yeah, you married, married a woman. Yeah, in Was she from Carlisle? Uh, Penrith is about 18 miles. Are they making yeah. mints there, do they? Or no? Not uh, no, that's Kendall. Kendall, Kendall right. Kendall, 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 no, that was the war thing, Dave. We're, yeah, we're so the old. Like, where are you from, Timbuktu? Yeah, yeah. yeah, it was the same back in the eighties. It, it, it yeah. used to be a joke. <laughs> like, you've ruined it. Do you know that? <laughs> Unbelievable. So you were from Manchester originally. Yeah. Please don't tell me you're a Manchester United or Man City fan underneath no. it. Good S man. Soft child of Liverpool. Uh, oh well. Right. Okay. <laughs> you, uh, you get more. Uh, more uh, uh, okay. I know. Well, listen, Change your allegiances, all like back in the day, this is going to get even worse I now. Look, I look at your it, back in the day, it was Rochdale. I used to go to the Rochdale. Yeah, oh, we, we Rochdale. They got a chip shop there, haven't they? Well, it's it's like, you're next to it. Uh, yeah, but they got a chip <laughs> shop at Rochdale, which is built into a, like a terrace house, like Coronation yeah. Street. Fantastic. Uh, unbelievable. I'm looking at your ground. It's not had much done to it, has it? No, I'll show them the picture. What picture? Which picture? One that I sent you. That's a dirty picture. No, it's not a dirty picture. What's that? Then? As I say, you'll see it's not much done. That, um, so it's really well, like, that's much like it is, yeah? So so other, than the, the, other than the east the end, it's pretty oh, much right, yeah, yeah. Yeah, But this, you're you're doing big redevelopments in the office, I hear? Yeah, now the <clears> high tax have taken over. They've, 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 say this, they've put marquees up above here. They've put the big screen for the footy on. Uh, these banners and that weren't here. Uh, What is going on? I know. <laughs> so yeah, so they're moving all the hospitality. The east stand, which usually will be in, yeah, okay. has never been finished. No. So it's been up since 98. Yeah, because it's, it's a strange stand because it goes past, the, past, the, yeah, past yeah. the corner flag. Well, the original plan when Michael Knighton. Oh, yeah, 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 we yeah. remember him. Yeah, we, why did why did he take over Carlisle and not Man United? But that's <laughs> another thing. That's another, uh, yeah, the, the, I think the ground was going to move that way. Right, okay. And, and you... Uh, like the new owners? Oh yeah, yeah, so far, yeah. They've not come in, they've not promised the world. No. You know what I mean? They've not said, oh, we're going to be in the Premier League within five seasons. The only they're scary saying, thing... Right, we're going to step by step. But the main thing is trying to keep us up in yeah, League One this I'm, season. I'm, actually, now you said you're 23rd, 
Yeah. That's a bit scary. Yeah, we're three points behind. Um, Exeter, I think. No. Um, Cheltenham. No, Cheltenham four. Who's bottom of the league, Josh? Hopefully, Redden. <laughs> so yeah, Reading's one of them. We're three behind Reading and we're three behind another team. Yeah. yeah. Uh, who else done that? Fleetwood, Cheltenham. But we've played them in recent weeks and we're not a good result against Leave. them. So it's it's here. Like, look at him now. He's, he's having a look. Me and Dave go back 50 years ago Reading, to the football. Cheltenham. Cheltenham. You listen Cheltenham, to this, yeah. We've been going together football on and off 50 years, Oxford United. And we look at all this technology that yeah. we were talking about. Yeah, we, we, had up here like, about we, we had no How we had to get the the shoot magazine and keep the league yes, tables. Yeah, you move the teams that. up and down. Yeah. yeah, that's very sad, isn't it? And now they just whip out that phone. Yeah, and they can yeah. just do what they like. But looking at this and what you just said, 23rd in Division 1. Um, it'd be a shame if you did go down. Um, yeah, it, it, well, Simon came in, we were... At the foot of, right, 18 months ago, we're at the foot of uh, Division League Two. Right, okay. And he's performed miracles last season. So, and we've pretty much, well, we've three new players signed this window, but we've pretty much got the same squad as what he did when he took over. Okay. And he's worked miracles, like to, to for the run that we're on, won the playoff final. And yeah, so we're we probably. A year ahead, of, yeah. Uh, so now it's catching up. So see how we've so Neil in midfield look good. Uh, the lad from Harrogate up front we've signed, and then we've got the Bradford keeper who's well, we, making his debut. We, we've today. got a new keeper today, yeah. actually. Uh, and who's your favourite player? Um, Gibbo probably. Jordan Gibson. Okay. Yeah. But looking he's at the one to watch out for, is he? Where does he play on the park? Oh, sorry, midfield or winger? Yeah. But looking at this ground. Um, we as a football club, Oxford United, we had a, a ground called the Manor Ground. I don't know yeah. if you remember that. We've now been in the Kassam 21, 22 years. We're now leaving that. Right? Yeah, I didn't realise you They're going to have another man. ground. Uh, touch wood, it's all going to happen. The Kazam's not that old, is it? It's 24 years old and we're going to move again to a, a new stadium just outside Oxford or on the edge of Oxford. When I look around at this stand, me and Ross years ago, probably late 1979, 78, 79, we travelled up here and we were 10 minutes late getting into this ground and the police said to us, you're not coming in. Jeez. We climbed the stand at the back oh, the of the ground the, yeah, yeah, yeah. and cool got that. in. And one of my mates, who's a really good geezer, said, if you think I've travelled 300 miles to be turned <laughs> out of this ground, we're climbing over. Yeah, yeah. And we climbed over and we come here, but this is probably a third or fourth visit to this ground but it's a long way just very very quickly what do you reckon the score is going to be today be honest do you know what use a lot of flying in playoff position yeah, so we're a bit we need at the moment. a win yeah. if we don't win today I think we're pretty much doomed like alright so we're going to ask your, so your I'm, son I'm, I'm, I'm going to go I'm going to go 2-1 to Carla. 2-1 to Carlo. 2-1 to Carlo. Ross, come on, mate. I want 2-0. I'd be happy-ish with the draw, but I think we'll probably shave this one. I don't we shave this one 2-1 or 2-0. Uh, we came up here when we got promoted in 2016, and I think we brought about 2,500 that day. Probably going to be a third. 2,500 today. It's going to be 2,500. <laughs> a long, long old way. Yeah. Well, bearing in mind, Reading stuffed us 5-1, didn't they? What, here? No, at, uh, at the, the Red okay. or whatever it's called now. All right, well, it's really been great you know, <laughs> speaking to you and uh, yeah. speaking to this young lad. Yeah. How old are you, mate? Uh, 11. 11. He just told me you were 16. <laughs> what do you reckon to that, then? Do you want a beer? Do you want a beer? <laughs> yeah, I bet you do. Thanks very much no, for talking. Yes, Cheers, very much. Cheers. Cheers.